What's up guys, uh, Kenny from the future here. Before we get into the video, I just wanna say, uh, I was you know, kind of reviewing some of the footage and it is a little shaky. I don't know if I just shake a lot or what, but uh, it, I mean, just kind of bear with me. I don't mean to make you seasick, uh, but you'll get the point. And uh, yeah, it's kind of just like a low light situation. So I'm sure that doesn't help out the sensor and everything. So just kind of bear with me, uh, but I think it's a cool video. So I hope you enjoy. Here it is. Yo, yo, what's up guys? So right now I'm in my truck. We are heading to my job, which is the Chance Theater in Poughkeepsie. Uh, there's no show today, but I have a show Friday and Saturday. So I'm going in to just check everything over and do a little bit more training. We got a new lighting board, so I want to, you know, just get a little more time on it. My brother is the head LD, and he's the one that is training me. Figured I'd bring you guys along. Uh, probably shouldn't be recording and driving at the same time, but whatever. Uh, but we're heading there now. It's about 10, 15 minutes away. I'm pretty close to it. Uh, I worked there like 2008 to 2016 and then took a little bit of a break um, but now we're pretty much back i am covering for my brother you know whenever he can't work and the other the other guy ray um, so this friday and saturday i have a show so kind of just wanted to get brushed up on some things that i haven't done in a while and learn the new board and figured we can make kind of like a new style video almost like a little bit of a vlog style obviously the other videos aren't going to stop uh didn't have a video last week because i had an sd card problem but we got that figured out and uh yeah so we're heading there now we'll be there probably in about 10 minutes so uh yeah we'll see you when we get there all right all right so we are here can't use my normal door because someone's sleeping on the dock uh poor guy's homeless i guess but whatever so we are going in the front of the building hopefully my brother will let me in here i'm not sure what door he's at here let's knock on this one i don't have a key Do, do, do. Just waiting for him here so he can let me on in here. Hey. We have plenty of towels, thanks. <laughs> it's, dark. it's dark in here, yeah. It's all right. Yeah. Look at this place. Super, super cool. Everything's off right now, but I was just here last night. I worked for Spoon, kind of like a old fogey, not really my type of music, that's for sure. But this place has been around for a long, long time and uh, it's one of a kind for sure. So we'll head up to the stage real quick now. This is the E room. That's where all the amps and stuff are. That's where my buddy Billy goes to hide. So I'll probably just kind of go through the board and go through each pair. All right. Well, whatever. I'm not scared of the ladder, but. All right, so we're heading up on the balcony. Going up to the lighting board. It might be a little dark, but you can still see. Do, 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 do. Yeah. Hello. This is the lighting board up here. <coughs> Is it up on my page already or no? Yeah. 
All right, so we're just gonna do some focusing and then we'll walk around a little bit. So right now he's just got the focus stick. He's focusing in a little bit. We had a show last night and moved a bunch of lights around, so. <laughs> this is the new board. All digital. All really cool. So right now I'm just going through each dimmer channel and bringing up each set of lights so he can focus it in and get it back to position. This place is awesome though. So much history in here. Uh, recently the owner, Frank, passed away. And then our, our head lighting guy, Bob, that trained us, he passed away. Uh, so it's been kind of uh, crappy around here, but we're making the best of it. We're still chugging along. And uh, yeah. So this is basically the view from the lighting board. You're pretty much on top of the world, which is awesome. Uh, I love sitting up here because you can just really get a good sense of everything. But uh, you definitely have a good view. Let me flip this around and focus. You're pretty much at the top, top of the balcony when you're up here. There are basically three steps of the balcony. Uh, you got the first step there by the railing, uh, the second step, and then up here, and then you step up again, and that's where the lighting board is. So, pretty cool. Um, definitely love that the lighting board is kind of up here away from everyone, especially when there's not a big show. And uh, no one's up here, kind of up here by yourself. So it's, it's nice, <laughs> kind of away from everyone. But this place is awesome. Yo, what year was this place built again? Uh, 1911. 1911 this place was built. So that just goes to tell you. And uh, many, 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 uh, many of people have played here, many of people. I can't even tell you. I can show you the back of my shirt, which has a good list, and that's still not all the people that have played here. Um, but it's definitely an amazing room. Sounds amazing. Like I said, we're kind of just in the middle of converting over from analog to digital everything. What is this board again? Camsys. This is a Camsys. It's a MQ80. MQ MQ80? Yeah, it says it on it. <laughs> no, it says Campsys Max, uh, Magical. Yeah, MQ Magical. Uh, whatever, same thing. You got it. <laughs> That's one of the spot op positions over there, which we haven't really used in a while. I think the last time we, <laughs> I think the last time we did that was uh, like Ted Nugent when he was here. <clears throat> Some poor ball guy was. Uh, he was standing right in the beam of my uh, spotlight, and by the end of the night, he had like super bad sunburn on the back of his head. <laughs> I was just frying this guy all night. So, it's pretty cool though. Like I said, I love being up here. Do, 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 do. Just walking down to the balcony here. Kind of just some steps that step down there. Trying to focus in. It's kind of a low light. Sorry that it's so dark, but. Chandeliers are awesome. And you got that big speaker there that, that hasn't worked in so many years, but it's kind of cool, so we keep it there. Are you ready for the next one? Uh. Mm. This is the view from above the pit. Before uh, Frank passed, he put a lot of money into the woodwork and everything. We did new floors, uh, new carpet, painted the stage, a bunch of new speakers and stuff. So 
it's really sad that he didn't get to enjoy all the hard work he did. Um, it's a really tough situation, honestly. This place is probably 100% haunted. <laughs> As soon as I turn all the lights off and uh, to go to leave, I try to get out of here pretty quick. <laughs> so this fan is for the haze machine. It's all gumped up. It's pretty, uh, it's pretty gross. <laughs> Bye, Next. Uh, blue riser. Yeah, it looks great. That's the one that's playing. Oh, no. Go to the other one that says blue riser and read for that one. Uh, blue riser. Oh, hold on. Leave that up too or no? Yeah, you can leave both up. Okay. So right now we're just kind of cycling through all the dimmer channels and uh, kind of bringing up each one. It's all touch screen. And then that brings up, uh, brings up all the lights on stage so that he can focus them with the focus stick. We have a stick that we do a lot of this with so we don't have to get on a ladder. Um, 99% of the time, we'll do it with the stick. Sometimes we do it with the ladder, though. These things are awesome. I'm not sure where these came from, but they've been here forever. And there's another one on this side. So current situation, there's squirrels above me. There's like two, two really fat ones that live up there. You can see the shadows every once in a while. But uh, yeah, that's where they live. It's their little house. <laughs> it's pretty funny. Turned my ISO up, so it'll probably be a little bit brighter now. Going to get my drink. Oh, yeah, we have that. It's the lion in the cage with the little butler serving him a beer. <laughs> yeah. Creaky stairs. Surprised I haven't fallen through these things yet. Oh. drum riser right now. He's changing a bowl because it is messed up. <laughs> yeah, I was going to bring gloves, but I didn't either. The band dressing rooms are up those stairs there. It goes up, then goes up again. And then there's like a window up in that area that you can watch from, which is pretty cool. And then the electrics room for us is up in that area where that little blanket over the window is. That's just for all like the ropes for all the electrics go to and uh, where all the breakers and stuff are and where we keep all our bulbs and supplies. And this is the loading ramp right there. So these two, I call them zombie doors, because it's like a zombie apocalypse style door. <laughs> but look at this door, I mean, this has so many write, so much writing from different bands on it. It's really amazing. I couldn't even tell you the people that have signed this thing. So it's really, really cool. 
seven dust head pe this uh this says soulfly snot incubus uh, head pe so that's really cool one of those guys did it i mean you just can't find that type of stuff in any other venue this thing it's just such a classic venue that it's insane it really is insane honestly we'll go check out the uh the lighting board or the uh sound board down those hallways are the bathrooms uh, this is the e-room and all the amp racks and stuff in it all of our microphones and cables and everything plus that's where we go when we want to hide from people this is the sound booth we have a uh, nice new can't really see it but it is a uh, it's a Midas M32 we just got that sorry that it's so dark literally all the lights are off in this place uh, the bar is over in that direction even though you can't really see it our dinner machine which is the vendor a uh, little vending machine I call it my dinner machine that's over there uh, a lot of lights aren't on in here so sorry that it's so dark and that the focus is probably really bad uh, this is the pit area. This is the sound system over here. But when you look up, that's what you see. It's just really cool looking, man. You can't find that type of work in any, any other building. You found one? Yeah. You know what time it is? It's pizza time, pizza time, baby. Oh yeah. It's a little sweaty in here right now. Pizza time. So we just changed some bulbs out. Uh, creaky stairs. Now it is time. What? <laughs> Food time. Where are you eating? Up here? Jesus, listen to this guy. Pizza time, baby. Let's see. Oh, man. Franz would hate this. Yeah, baby. Time to eat. See you in a few. All right, so we're finally done here. I'm going to get out of here. I'm going to go home, maybe edit up this video. So I uh, hope you like this one. It was a little bit different than the normal videos, normal guitar reviews. Figured we could do it in a different place than we normally do. So, uh, yeah, uh, probably have some guitar reviews coming up soon, some project videos. I did a poll, and a few of you voted that you liked the project videos, which is weird because the numbers on the project videos are way down compared to the other ones. So I don't know. But I'll keep making the videos and uh, yeah, have fun, stay safe, drink a lot of water, and we'll see you in the next one.